Welcome to Melu Classroom. We have learned so many letters, related words, sound and how to write. Yes? Yeah. Today, new letter we are going to learn. The sound and the words and how to write again. Okay? That letter is G. So, you want to learn? Yes. Get set? Go! Yes, children. As I told you, today's new class is about letter G. So, can you see the uppercase G and lowercase G? Yes. And now, what is the sound of letter G? It has two sounds. The long sound and short sound. The long sound of letter G is J. The long sound of letter G is G. The long sound of letter G is? Yes, G. And the short sound is G. The short sound of letter G is G. Okay. Please remember children. The long sound of letter G is G. And the short sound is G. And now it's time to learn new words that start with letter G. See here children. What is this animal? The tallest animal, right? It is giraffe. What is this? Giraffe. Giraffe, yes? Now, what is this? Gloves. G, gloves. G, gloves. Where you have to wear this? To your hands. Am I right? Yes. See children, what is this picture? There are some flower pots. There are some plants. It is called G garden. G garden. And see what is this? Lot of waste is there. Am I right? It is called G garbage. G garbage. And we'll make a sentence out of these four words. Let us see what it is. Giraffe wore gloves and picked garbage from the garden. So now tell me children, if you want to touch the waste from your house or from your garden, you should not touch with your bare hands. Always you should have a protection. How you can protect? By wearing gloves. Do you do that? Okay, if you do that, very good child. If you are doing it, it is well and good. If you are not doing it, try to wear gloves from hereafter. If you want to touch garbage. Okay, right. Now we will learn few more words that start with letter G. See here, G goose, G goose. So where does goose lives? Yes, in water. It is a water animal. G glass. You know, right? What is glass? You can drink milk. You can drink water. You can drink drink a soft drink or something like that. G gate. So to our homes, in the front side there will be a lock, right? With the gate. And G guide. G guide. Guide may be a person or it may be a book who will direct us to some kind of information. Okay, children? So, we have learned so many words, but we also have to learn how to write them. Am I right? So, get ready with your book and pencil. Yes, children, I am ready with my four rules. So, let us learn how to write few words by using sounds. The first word that I am going to teach you is garden. What is the word, children? Garden. It's full of flowers. 
flower pots so which i told you in the just now right which i told you just now so we will write garden word so how many syllables can we divide this word into yes only two syllables we can make out of it the first syllable is gar and the second one is den okay so we will write gar so which letter sounds ga it is g right so write g and there is a sound which you have to write a and the last sound in the first syllable is r which letter sounds r yes it is r so write r so we have completed the first syllable gar and the second syllable is den so what all sounds included children d a and n so which letter sounds d yes d so write d here and the second sound is a which letter sounds a yes it is e and the last sound is n so which letter sounds n n Yes. Now read with me, children. Garden, garden. Okay. Now we'll move on to second word, which is glass. Okay. So this can be divided into two syllables. Gla can be one syllable and s can be second syllable. But when you are pronouncing glass, you have to stress the s sound in the last. So we will see how to write it the first syllable is gla right so what all sounds are included g l and a so you know very well it should be g l a write with me and the second syllable is but it should be stressed and i told you when the letter is got stressed you need to write two times so the sound should be written two times which is letter s so our glass is done and now the short word i am going to tell you children it is gun okay what it is it is gun and what all sounds included there is a g sound there is a sound and n sound n right so which letter sounds g it is g which letter sounds a yes it is u and n sound can, should be pronounced by letter n so write n so we are done with g gun g a gun okay and the last word which i am going to tell you is green what is green children it's a color right uh, so shall we write green spelling So what is the beginning sound it is g so here need not to divide into any syllable it is short right so we can write as a one syllable but tell me what all sounds are there the first one is g and the second sound is r and the third is e and fourth sound is n right so let us take the first sound which is g Which letter sounds g? Yes, it is g. So write g. And the second sound is r, right? So r we should write. And children, when there is e sound, which letter has to be doubled? 
Yes, letter E. So, E you should write for two times. And the last sound is N. Which letter sounds N? Yes, it is N. Yes, so we are done with the green spelling. So, we have completed all the four words. So, let us have a reading activity now. So, read with me children. Garden. Garden. Glass. Gun. Green. Okay. So, children, hope you understood how we have written all these words by using phonetic sounds. But what is your job? You should always keep reading and writing. Okay? And not only G, what all letters we have learned from the previous classes also, you have to have a practice. Okay? Do not forget. Bye-bye. See you in the next class.